And we're back for you mere seconds for me a life battle. In other words, like 10 to 20 minutes. Very small life span. Hey, it's the lifetime of like a fly. So I'm not entirely inactive. Okay, all sentient beings. Let's, let's... Hello, all sentient beings. The Doan Hill? Now time for the Doan Wood. Wait, how far exactly are we gonna go? Look at big world map here. 99! That's unacceptable! <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Let's go! Enemies may sometimes drop souls known as anima when defeated. Anima can be used via Metallia's bucket list. A certain facet can actually increase anima to drop rate. I don't even know what most of Metallia's bucket list does! Outrageous! Alright, let's get the exploration underway. Sentient creatures, sentient and non-sentient. In case your dogs are watching out there, folks, and they're just serenaded by the sound of my voice. I have no idea. Maybe even cats. I don't know. Maybe you just leave your computer on and put it in front of your turtle cage. I don't know what you people do. So let's keep going. And, you know, and maybe I should just do humans and not. It's worked for me so far. I don't think I've offended anyone yet. Actually, I want to be the thing that your parents tell you not to watch because I will rot your brain and corrupt your innocence. Now let's get to it, folks. One day I will be the thing they have PTA conferences to have to discuss counter strategies on. That is the dream. I need your help to get this. This voice kind of annoys me. I don't know why I keep using it. <laughs> Maybe I should start talking like Zach Brannigan. Pick a knife for lure. We go on a double and a half. Boom, shut the lights No, I think this is slowly rotting my brain since I attached it to a cat again. Yep, yep. That brain matter is currently cooling inside of my headphones. Outrageous. Alright, whatever. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. <clears throat> God 
getting kind of scared of what dominate actually means to these people. Alright, let's raid this house. Owner Muscular Man. Sorry, whenever I hear the term muscular man, I just think of that one blonde dude from Full Metal Alchemist. You know, Tracer, it's not yourself here. The real man does whatever that person is like the most. The real man is. He's also really persistent, and once he picks his target, he'll have to see my die. Rust gun will go down to be even full grown adult get gobbled up to save Nancy Cliff. Well, I killed that thing for fun! Hey! So you don't have to worry about it anymore! Oh, uh, man! Down the bomb! Zyro's Spear 2! When Zyro's Spear 1 isn't enough, go out hey! there and buy a Zyro's Spear 2! We guarantee it's extremely sorry! Hey! Or your money bag. <laughs> no reasons. What? Three? What? On the exchange. Yeah. 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 What did you do with Rondis? What the hell do you do in these houses? I'm getting nervous. It's just getting real. What the Wait. hell do you do when you dominate the houses on tonight? I want to detail a written report of what you do so I know exactly what time I'm gonna be. You're gonna be arrested for. Yeah, any other places that need to be dominated? Name this egg. When you want an egg, but don't want to know where it came from, you get name this egg. Are you trying to have a tire kick them? No, huh, you're not. Our tire is supposed to be huge. I'd love to see it for once. How about twice? Would you like to see it twice? In that case, buy a nameless egg. You may get the chance to visit. How dare they! Time to murder them in their sleep! No, not the books! Don't burn the books! I like books! If we ever encounter a game that loading screens is long enough, I may just start reading aloud books! And they will definitely probably be R-rated books, or X-rated, I don't know, whatever I feel like at the time. We won't even match. Let's begin. You shall be dominated. Ooh, an arrogant beat. Nope, 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 you beat me. That little shit. Tonight shall die. Okay, even match is a uh, means basically if you get 50 percent chance, you're gonna get fucked over. Damn. I get weak on all the damn time. I did not. Maybe hold off now. Okay, now we can stop the hundred night. Okay, wait. Uh, Equipment and 
level contributes to uh, how hard it is to do that sort of stuff. That's just why I was checking my equipment to see if I was using the best of what I got. And should I try again? I thought I just heard... Yep, I hear a pillar nearby. I make weird sounds because I'm the honey snack. And, and the person controlling me is definitely not fighting you do with insanity for no apparent reason. What? Three? You doctor. Fight. Mark my Fight. words, I'll be back. Ghost 
this isn't another... Is this the boss? Did I hit the boss? I don't even think I have enough time to hit a boss. Hmm. Is it around here? Yeah, I don't have the to do voices. Presence. I'm gonna drink some water now. Yeah. Help! Oh, that means, yeah, there's a boss. Hmm. If I'm hearing voices, that means it's probably the boss. Uh, you know what, let's just power up here. Fine, we can kill things fast, can't we? This is a huge mistake that'll backfire in our league. And another ghost on a feed, really? Now, now, this Look time, my promise to present you with a tale most tragic. The tragedy extract is only filling about half of the flask right now, you see. <laughs> I have another pretty sad story to tell of a young man who enlisted so he can afford meds for his sick mommy. Enough! Is killing one person not satisfying enough for you? Don't make me sound so evil. He collapsed all on his own. It wasn't my fault. And the way he died wasn't dramatic at all. I mean, the small old man ran away, and now that guy's the only one left, you know? Enough, you lowlife! Release my subordinate at once! <laughs> a lowlife, am I? How rude to be called a lowlife by a lowlife like yourself! <laughs> a true lowlife, desiring tragedy extracts so bad that you'll sacrifice your subordinates. Sacrifice us? No! I didn't mean for... Why are you getting so remorseful? Once he dies, everything's solved. The ones who ridiculed you as the dog princess will vanish. And you get the tragedy extra. Sounds like a pretty good deal, lady. Now I can go back to the kingdom as a dog. <laughs> That's called a win-win. Let's be touched by a fantastically sad finale. Kind of with the tree fairy on this. You should let him die. Oh wow, you actually managed to kill fake ghost centipedes. I'm impressed. <laughs> Master Viscal? <laughs> uh, Very ungrateful, subordinate. You really should just let it die. Huh? What's all this? Also, a great game if you like souls, and you want to something free. Sacrificing yourself? Sacrificing yourself? Seriously? <laughs> That's not sad at all. Not at all, it's not even a good dramatic moment. What is this? Like, seriously? Lame, 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 lame! Ah, it's so boring! Ah, oh, Bokka. Oh, here for. Morgan? What are you here for? You're not going to do something even more boring, are you? Well, you're guarding a pillar, so I need to kill you! This thug of a fairy thinks he's hot shit because of the magic power he's borrowing. Make him pay the price for messing with my toys, Hundred Knight! Yeah! We're five years old and we don't care! <laughs> There's no way you can beat me! I'm the protector of the pillar! Yeah, that's what every single other protector of the pillar said. And guess what? They're dead! <laughs> don't underestimate me! You do, you'll regret it so much that you'll wish you were dead. Come on, Majora's Mask ripoff. Bring it on! Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah! Go, you! Oh, yeah! Oui! Okay, so magic useless. It seems like flashing stuff does the most. Hmm, I kind of forced him into a bad corner for that, though. So Need to get out of here. 
Alright, come on, bring it on. Bring it on, you Majora's Mask wannabe. Come on, bring it! Bring it, motherfucker! Come on, let's see what you got! You ain't got the stone! I'm horrible at those uh, just right movements. <laughs> oh, if I can just grab another one. Okay, maybe uh, stick a. that. I don't trust myself. There's less than that. This one's actually difficult, slightly difficult compared to everyone else so far. Come on. Killer protectors practice. Yes, Mr. Dodge. Fuck you, buddy. And it's dead. Yes. Story of how the Nintendo Knight successfully protected one of its trademark properties. Next time on the Nintendo Knights, someone's doing a fan project of a Metroid game. It's time to murder them. I like making the jokes. I make the funny jokes. You, you laugh at my dog, so did I kill you? But, but a wound like this, the, the pillar will help me to recover right away! Yeah! But, the, the pillar, but your protector is still here! That means you're already dead, buddy. Or good as dead. Pillar, what are you doing? My, my strength is... I'm gonna die! If this keeps up, I'm dead meat! Yes, A third-tier fairy like you thinking you were a real badass because of the Pillar. Your luck's run out. You've pissed off the Swamp Witch, Metallia! Now, all you can hope to do is writhe in agony and die for me! The, the infamous Swamp Witch Metallia? T Damn! If the wicked Swamp Witch didn't get in my way, everything would have worked out just fine! I would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for you meddling kids and that stupid dog! To win people's trust, and then watch them cry out when they're betrayed. I wanted to see the despair and hate. How boring. It, it was all to get my revenge. I trusted humans long ago, but they betrayed me. I worked tirelessly for them. I offered my powers to the trees, helping a human village to flourish. But when their lives grew stable, they stopped giving offerings to me. They lost all respect for us fairies. Not right. That's not right at all, sir. So, to bring despair back to those humans, I borrowed Duchess Valentine's powers to become a protector. Really pathetic there, buddy. Wow, what a lame story. A coward who runs from reality, huh? She thought that was a good sob story? Grow up, you spineless little prick. What? Uh, what you call my story? Lame? Y you Who do you think you are? The Swamp Witch Metallic, you little shit! You filthy, tasteless bitch of a witch! I won't let you get away with this! Wow, you finally managed to rhyme. I'm proud of you. 
disgusting mind. I'll force you to get lost in your own thoughts and seal that filthy mouth. <laughs> What's going on? Weird. This is so weird. What's with her? What's with her? <laughs> this sack of crap thought he could actually do something about me? No, no, no way. <laughs> I guess a little bit of hate fueled revenge doesn't produce a tragedy at all. Which I can't. <coughs> oh, you're still breathing. Please. My last wish. My subordinate died because of me. Please. Bury pigs. <sighs> Properly. As for my ugly corpse. Just put it somewhere it won't be seen. A society that can't appreciate dog ladies doesn't deserve to exist. Let's burn it all to the ground. Show me the items you've collected. You know, the chicory bug leaf and flame frog egg. Show them to me. Monday night, take the chicory bug leaf and flame frog egg from Visco's item shop. Since I can't save right now, and this is the last video in the recording session, we're just gonna keep going for a bit. The hunt tonight gives a chicory bug leaf and flame frog eight to Metallia. Huh. You managed to get them. Close, but not good enough. I can't make the antidote without the tragedy extra. Great. Which? Um. What now? Not even I can make an antidote without the ingredients. Just give up and suffocate yourself. I see. I suppose it no longer matters. Uh... Ugh, you're dying too slow. If you have to spit something out before you croak, say it already. Hundred Knight. If she comes back from near death again, break her damn skull. Uh... Great witch. I truly wish... To thank you, I leave the rest in your capable hands. From the bottom of my heart, thank you, Forest Witch, Lady Malia. Oh, you shouldn't have said huh. that. You're thanking the wrong person. After all, my name is Metalia. Metalia? Hell yeah! The Great Swamp Witch Metallia! What? No way! You aren't Lady Malia? No, nope, we killed vomiting her. That whore is gone. G gone By that, I mean she's left this damn world. I sent her off with my own two hands. W what Well, you did tell I knew I said to skull. crush her skull if she came back from near death again. But you... Oh. Well. Looks like she finally died. <laughs> this is great! This is huh? just great! <laughs> Look at that. I don't know why. But I guess Luck's looking out for her today. Wait, is that the tragedy extract? I heard it! Really, I did! She definitely, definitely said it! That... that she killed the Great Witch of the Forest, Lady Malia! No wonder the life force of the forest has been on the decline! This is a very, very big deal! I need to let the other Great Witches know post-haste! I'll be quiet, you little Either snitch. way, she's a new player in this game, but she's quite the brat. Just you watch. I will definitely make you suffer through some awful things. If you can't even name them, shut up, go home. I, the Tar Witch Teresa, swear it. <laughs> Tar Witch? Really? Do they have a witch for everything?
Hello, and it turned out, yeah, there was still something left before I could save. I'm gonna try to see if I can fit this in somewhere. If not, you will see a supplementary video coming out. Sorry, a touch guard! I finally got a touch guard! Touch guard refers to some type of support units that the engine I can summon. Press the right stick of the touch, and the right side of the touch badge, access touch guard, and then press the L1 button and square button to summon it. When your touch guy helper appears, an icon will display at the bottom right of the screen and will deplete his time past the door when damaged. A limited number of touch guys can be summoned at once depending on attack. Cry point is displayed by type and use maximum 99 points at once as value covers on time. Touch can be acquired to progress the main story than you found on the field. Ability of each very great ladies is seeking out like a hungry bear. Recover a few amounts of 100 nights. Let's see if you acquire type 8 time bomb touch guy. Yay! We can now destroy those rocks! <laughs> How's that grab ya? Pretty surprised? What's going on? Th this is all you're doing! See, I can't. Uh, wait, this goes alive? Huh? What did you do Man, now? So loud. Come on out, Swamp Witch! You, you tricked me! You scheming hag of a witch! Yeah, if I can't just shove this in somewhere in the video, <laughs> I'm literally just gonna put this out as a second video, no I'm sure not. Very short one. And I'll be like, oh! Oh wow, Natalia, I didn't know you had such great days. <laughs> this is excellent! Look how big you've gotten! I think your stupid tits are each the size of a whole cooked turkey! They are quite splendid to behold. Yes. I'll let you know, sound more excited here, <laughs> man. On top of this, you came back from the precipice of death. How lucky can one idiot get? I... I will not sit here and be subject to such boorishness. What the hell? You've gotten better, but you've also gotten a real attitude, dog princess. What did you do to my body? You mad? I think of all things, you should be grateful to me. I made the antidote I promised you, and I even poured it down your mongrel throat. How is this any kind of antidote? You speak nonsense. This is so shameful. Oh, come on. You're just naked, bound in a swamp. <laughs> You're about three times the original size. Hey, stay right there. You will suffer my holy judgment. <laughs> I wouldn't move around so much if you don't want to reveal certain things, lady. I am a knight of Amataya, 56th member of the Inquisitors, Visco Dotrish. And you expect to be able to go back to the Inquisitors like that? You're literally a dog princess My giant. My assessment of the Swamp Witch Metalia. I acknowledge you as an evil witch! As a representative for the Inquisitors, those who slay evil witches, I will now take your life! Oh boy, you really are a glutton for punishment, aren't you, Visco? What? I think challenging an evil witch in her center of power is a good idea? <laughs> no, 96 damn, that took three days. Natalia, we don't want you to die! Yes, and finally I can save. I knew I should have ended that earlier, but I didn't. Eh, I knew I should have ended it before the boss fight, but I didn't. She has calmed down at last. Yay! What a handful. No matter how big she gets, she's still a mutt. She can't beat me. So the question is, what'll I do with her? Let's keep her like this. This is, this is just a great view. Uh, Let her fast. brine in the swamp until she becomes a pickled swamp dog? I admit, I do enjoy pickled meat more than I should. Hey, 
I was just kidding, you know. Not even I would readily eat a dog. Anyway, she said she was some kind of inquisitor or something, right? An inquisitor is also known as a witch hunter in some circles. I believe she's one of those. Well, not only has she been cursed by a witch and then betrayed by a witch, she's now completely failed her job as a witch hunter. Well, yeah, that much was obvious. Well, cute? Or so I'd want to say. But it seems like one of us doesn't really get it. Oh, 400 Very well. Allow me to explain in more detail to the stupid, uh, the naive, Sir Hundred Knight. Witch hunters capture evil witches seen as harmful to the kingdom and force them to reform or be executed. Those who take part in the witch hunting are known as inquisitors. I figured that much Bullshit. The people of this country have lived alongside us witches for ages. Who are they to call a witch evil? We're always selfish and wicked. Good and evil don't really apply. Either way, it's impossible for a stupid Inquisitor to catch me. I do recall some past rumors about a certain Swamp Witch and some Inquisitors who traveled here to deal with her. But they began to vomit profusely, creating a big to-do. Eventually, the noxious swamp gas finished them off. Ah, yes. Those floating bones in the swamp over there belonged to one such visitor from 58 years and 63 days ago. If your memory's that damn good, why can't you remember my name after being corrected once? Over the past 100 years, one went plop over there, and another went plop over there, and... Answer the damn question, well, Carlicino! That is why Sir Hundred Knight is the first real victim, er, uh, guest, in Master Leah's home. Yes. But now we have this one! Metallia! Damn it! What's wrong with you? Are you pissing me off on purpose? No, no, not at all. It seems as though Master Viscal has become our second guest. And she's not vomiting at all for being in the swamp. An uninvited guest. Whoa! What, what was I... I can't move! What is all this? This is the witch's doing. This is an outrage! Oh, I'm going to straight this instant! You know, Quit happened. barking, you damn mutt! If you still know your manners as a human, then at least show a smidge of gratitude. Yeah, you would be dead right now. What? You've got quite the ego to speak that way to me. <laughs> You've gotten so big that your beefy body is even more conspicuous. Like a giant meatball. What? what? I look this way because of you! And saying I'm a giant meatball? A meatloaf? A meathead? I didn't go that far. Silence! I won't forgive you, you third-rate witch! I will be sure to hammer the stake of justice into you! Oh, really? Yeah, it's not gonna happen. You already said you'd kill me. But now I get a stake of justice, and you call me the Swamp Witch third-rate? After failing to capture me? Your ignorance is pathetic. If you fail to capture a third rate witch, doesn't that make you a fourth rate wizard? I'll teach your body to understand the greatness of this third rate swamp witch. Oh, wait, this is getting good. Hundred Knight, shove this right up that dog's swampy ass. Wait. Oh my god, wait, what are you actually doing? Oh my god, what's going on? Yeah, please block out the train. Okay, shit's getting real here. What? What was that? The hell? You're still talking? That miracle drug should have gone into effect right away. Did I mess it up? Uh, then how about this liquid formula? I know for a fact this one works. It could be because of the curse already placed on her, she's resistant to this sort of shit. Considering you're bound in a swamp, that's all you're good for. Oh. 
managed to get your life free too. Tally, I force over her ring. Make sure it is one piece. Ugh. Hurry up and release me! I refuse to be part of your vile experiments! It's going a lot longer than I thought it would. You're not a pillar's protector, are you? Unless this is due to your ridiculous increase in size. Hmm. Oh well. I said it earlier, but you just stay put for the time being. What? Don't joke with me! Hurry and undo these ropes! Yeah, not happening. Okay. You look way too good like that. Let's leave this barking dog and get to work on our next target, Hundred Knight. Agreed! Let's go. Hey! Wait! Wait, I said! Now, that ring, is it important? Is it have sentimental value or is it important to your Act more one, Chapter 3. The Witch and the Great Duchess. Oh, God, this is going to turn into an episode something point five, isn't it? Where will you journey take you now? The Dowsing Crystal Act took you to different places. The next target's already been chosen. The Duchess Valentine's territory! Yeah, now I'm trying to catch on to your first consideration. That place in the other day, the one you did was in her jurisdiction. Her territory is back in advance, you're not up to my swamp now. It's a pretty bad situation for me. The Duchess is also a great place to fear for her magnificent powers. That is why she is sometimes called the Duchess of Flowers, the Great Witch of Valentine's. The Great Witch and the Duchess, don't joke at me. Only one person's allowed to be called the Great Witch, and that's me. The Great Swamp Witch of Valentine's. has got some nerve and crush on my territory. I got a lot of nice punishment ideas in the way. For the record, I do believe that you were the one to encroach on her existing territory, Master Leo. I'm Italian. The Duchess has also gained the right to govern her own land from a kingdom. Magnificent way, yeah. Antagonizing her would not be advisable in several different ways, I may say so myself. I not advisable, guys. Too late to get scared now out of the kingdom. I'm sure they've already noticed that we're here to pick a man's plan. They've already screwed with their land. Both of us are ready and willing to take the first swing. In a fight, you gotta strike first. That's an ironclad rule of battle. A great witch, Duchess of Paris. Those titles are just self inflated us. I'll teach them what a real great witch is like. You get me, huh? next pillar is going to be guarded by another stupid witch. Three soldiers are part of the hell of the place. Don't you dare run. No chicken's going to ruin my name. Ah, primitive. That good answer. Can't do it, Hunter Knight. I'm whatever one in your car. I don't care about some duchess. I'll strip her naked and put her in a proper place. She acknowledges a real great witch that'll do today. <laughs> ah, damn, that really hurts the voice. You have upgrades and added bugglers. You can use the full rock and an increase the level of gear. By leveling up here, you can increase its attack and defense. Your mouth attack can be upgraded depends on its rarity. Weapons are leveled up, but not that you can gain experience. And now it's safe! And goodbye humans and non-humans alike and good ever applies to you.